the madman of Muzanga. In a lively African village, there was a man named Ochuku. He seemed a bit crazy with his messy clothes and wild behavior, but strangely, people turned to him for advice when they faced problems. They feared him on the streets, yet sought his wisdom when troubles arose. Ochuku would sit beneath a big, old tree, talking to himself in a way that confused everyone. Villagers, despite their initial hesitation, would approach him cautiously, hoping to unravel the hidden meaning in his words. One day, as the sun set and shadows lengthened, an old woman named Amina bravely approached Ochuku. Ochuku, I need your help. Something troubles me deeply. She needed advice on something that deeply troubled her. Surprisingly, Ochuku's words, though cryptic, brought her comfort and clarity. Suddenly, a bright light surrounded Ochuku, astonishing everyone. He stood there transformed, no longer appearing mad. He explained that his apparent madness was a unique gift that allowed him to understand the world in a special way. The strange aura was a connection to something divine. News of Ochuku's change spread quickly. People now sought him not just for advice, but also for healing and guidance. The village, once unsure about him, now respected him as a wise elder. Ochuku continued helping his community, blending the odd wisdom from his mad days with the newfound clarity. The old tree, once just a quiet observer, became a symbol of the village's journey from doubt to profound understanding. The tale of Ochuku echoed through the generations in Africa, teaching that sometimes wisdom comes from the most unexpected places, and embracing the mysterious can lead to incredible transformation. Thanks for watching. Love from the Classic Series. Do you know that the wooden flute known as Oja holds a vital place in the cultural heritage of the Igbo people, indigenous to Nigeria in West Africa? It remains a key element in their musical traditions, crafted from bamboo or metal. Players generate varied notes by blowing air into one end and manipulating holes along the body. Skillfully carved from wood, the Oja contributes to the enchanting sounds of traditional Igbo music, often accompanied by other instruments in cultural events and activities.